Well, here we are at the Jazz Festival in Upton upon Severn. This is a small town and normally quite a peaceful one. But for one weekend in the year, they cram in 30,000 people and 60 bands. Summer Praise is here to join in. And in true festival style, we don't have a stage. We've got a Mississippi paddle boat. We're joined by festival goers and people from local churches. All we need now is some music. Let's strike up the band. Denise Lawrence and Storyville Tickle, and Keith and Marcia Penderbury. Well, everybody's raring to go, and we're in fine voice, so let's start off with one which everybody knows and sums up exactly where we are down by the riverside. Take it away, Marcia. Yeah. I'm gonna lay down my burden Down by the riverside Down by the riverside Down by the riverside I'm gonna lay down my burden Down by the riverside Ain't gonna study war no more Ain't gonna study war no more Ain't gonna study war no more I ain't gonna study war no more No more I'm gonna lay down my burden Ain't gonna study war no more. I'm gonna worship the Lord my King. Down by the riverside, down by the riverside, down by the riverside. Worship the Lord my King. Down by the riverside, study war no more. Well, ain't gonna study war no more. Ain't gonna study war no more. Ain't gonna study war no more. 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 Study war no I study why no more. 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 I Anyone like what you've got? Think it suits me? No? All right. During the summer months, there are hundreds of classical jazz and folk festivals happening all over the country as people come together to celebrate music. The Jazz Festival here in Upton is a relative newcomer, still only in its ninth year, but growing in popularity all the time. People come from all over Britain and indeed Europe. But they can't all squeeze in, so they bring their tents, caravans, boats, and anything else they can find. But why do they do it? It's the best festival in, in the country. This is, sorry, this is the nearest thing to New Orleans, to the jazz festivals in New Orleans. Yeah. And we go to a lot of festivals, but this one has to be the best. <laughs> Every year, every year, yes, yeah, we look forward to it. Just can't wait for the next one. I 
Upton Festival is uh, unique because the setting is right, the venues is right, and we have a river here where we can really go to town on New Orleans jazz, and that's what it's about. I think it's special because it's part of Upton. It's the Upton Jazz Festival, and it's in Upton, and all the people in Upton partake, and it's, it's a wonderful weekend, and we always have wonderful weather. Jazz is a happy music, and that's what it's all about. That's why it came along, you know, to make people happy. And every, everybody is happy here. It's, I don't know why. Let your light from the lighthouse shine on me. Oh, let it shine on Let it shine on One of the highlights of the festival for many people is the jazz service at the local parish church. jazz service. How did you find it, Anthony? I thought it was great. The miracle happened. It worked. Well, we put together an awful lot of random things. It, it starts off with me being given a list of songs. And then you've got to try and make it into a shape, like a sort of crossword puzzle, so it works as a service. And, well, I thought it did on the whole. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it did. And you don't really know till the morning. I didn't hear half the music until Wednesday night. 
I didn't know what it was going to sound like. D is that not uh, nerve-wracking? No. Terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoyed the service. Marvellous. Absolutely marvellous. I had jazz music in the church more often, it could fill the churches. <laughs> I love gospel music in the church. I think it livens it up and makes it happy. How does it feel to sing in a service like that? Oh, it's fabulous. That's absolutely wonderful. The warmth you get back from the congregation is absolutely incredible. Good. Well, everybody in there seems to be having a very good time indeed, I must admit. <laughs> the joint was jumping! <laughs> Trad Jazz Festival would be complete without a parade, Mardi Gras style. Now I believe they're just about to shut down the traffic and we've got 12 minutes to get from one side of the town to the other and just check out some of these umbrellas. Shirt. 
it's a beauty, isn't it? <laughs> That's great. Where does that come from? Ben brought it back from before me from Kingston, Jamaica. Right. And so I thought on a day like this it'd help the help the weather along and just had a bit of fun. Well, it's certainly very colourful, I must say. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you. Keep it up. official venues for bands at the festival, but people squeeze into every nook and cranny they can find, and some venues are decidedly odder than others. We have a different attitude in England about listening to jazz. Uh, in Europe, everybody listens to everything, so they like everything. But in England, it's all because of the class barriers, you know, people like one thing and not another. But uh, I, I like to think and hope that with what we play, that we actually make, uh, turn people on to listening to more jazz as well. How y'all doing? It's much better. 
Jazz is a happy form of music. No matter how sad you are, it makes you feel good inside. It, it brings someone out from the inside of you. It's a good, happy feeling. When you come to a jazz festival and you listen to the jazz service as you have this morning, I mean, anybody that's failed to be moved by something like that, I mean, just talking about it makes you feel moved. I mean, we've played a few uh, uh, hymns this afternoon, and, and, and the people just really appreciate the, the way it is different and the way it makes you feel and, and, and what you get out of it.
Jesus, granted Jesus, if you please. 